Hi guys, okay, so I'm running late. It's as per usual, but I wanted to check in with you guys because today is gonna be a busy day. I'm gonna go to the 437 loft right now to just check out their loungewear collection, pull a few pieces, get a few pieces that I like, and also I just tried out the Makeup by Mario palette um, and I absolutely love it. But yeah, I'm just gonna get going and I'll take you guys along with me today. So I'm gonna be trying on just these two pieces that I picked out. Um, originally kind of wanted to try this in black, but honestly, in person, this color is actually very cute. So let's try these two on and see how they go. This is the first piece, super cute. These are so comfy and very flattering. I mean, this mirror is actually the flattering part. Cute. Right, right, right. Um, <laughs> yeah. I really like them. So these pants are the small. Okay, so I'm checking in. I'm just parked outside waiting for my friend Winnie because we're gonna go shoot two looks today. I'm shooting this one. The 437 loft was so much fun. The girls were so sweet there and I ended up picking two of the items out that I tried on. Um, and I ended up sticking with the medium in the bottom. Guys, this is Winnie. We're gonna go shoot now, so <laughs> see you guys later. <laughs> guys, we finished shooting our first look, but that was a struggle. It was a struggle. Like, the wind. <laughs> Nothing this was in our favor. Foreshadowing <laughs> winter shooting. Oh God. Anyways, I guess we'll give an OOTD rundown of both our looks. I'm wearing a thrifted collar, Burberry sweater, Burberry skirt. Top shop boots. Cute. How about you? H&M, Everlane. Cute. I think H&M too. Nice. All three old and then Zara. boots. Ooh, so cute. <laughs> okay, guys, second look. This is like all from H&M, pretty much. H&M, H&M. These are like something called Lux, um, and also turtleneck from my mom's closet. Oh. So cute. Pretty much, we're done shooting. We're gonna go to an event early. I'm gonna switch out of these boots. And yeah, I'll see you guys when we are at the event. Also, this music is killing the vlog. <laughs> so we made it to the croissant place. They're opening soon. There's actually a friend in the world, and this is actually the first location in all of North America. We just wanted to put it in this small section here so it looks Wow. Up. No, so, this one is our chocolate hazelnut flavor. Guys, we secured some goods. I'm so excited to try all of these. We both oh, got one. Yeah. <gasps> oh my god, they look ah! amazing. Anyways. Okay guys, I think that's the end of the vlog today. I just finished doing my makeup and I want to test out for the second time this Revlon blow drying brush. I tried it the first time and I filmed it and I just was like... I don't know if I was doing it right or like it just wasn't coming out to the way I wanted and I heard a lot of great reviews so I'm gonna try it again I really like this because it has like different settings like this. it's really loud what I'm gonna do this time my hair is 90% damp I'm gonna try these out too to help like keep my hair and then I should get some clips so now that I have this I'm gonna use this. Perfect. The first time around when I did this, I used bobby pins and that just took forever because I was like putting bobby pins on both sides. So what I think I'm gonna do is let it cool off for a bit more. I'm gonna hairspray it right now. So I think usually I'd probably do this first and then do my makeup and then while I do my makeup, this cools, this sits for a bit more and then it'll be like extra curly. Um, I'll check in with you guys in like five minutes. Okay, so it's been like 10 minutes. Um, I'm just gonna take them out now. Let's hope for the best.
okay I'm not mad about it what do you guys think do you think this blowout worked the thing with my hair is I feel like it looks really nice right now but I think throughout the day it's just gonna die since I will be recording today, you guys can kind of see if this even lasts on me. Okay, honestly, I don't know how it would have looked if I just used it without my rollers. I feel like the rollers really helped hold it. Maybe within this video, I'll use this again without having to use a roller. And then we can see how it goes. Maybe. Maybe we'll do that. So I'm in the plaza that has like everything bubble tea lcbo and they also have like desserts so i'm gonna go get her desserts from this place look at the detailing of these so pretty guys i was super annoying <laughs> i made him move that little dessert and it fell <laughs> i'm that annoying customer Guys, they were all so cute, I couldn't choose, so I just got like a couple. <laughs> Hopefully they don't tip over. He taped the bottom for me. So now I'm just gonna drive downtown to give them to her. So I feel like this video is kind of everywhere. So I'm gonna take a photo, package some orders, and I kind of want to make this bubble tea thing, so I thought I'd just film it and it'd be fun. I feel like the other day I used my Revlon thing, but for a quicker and faster results, I'm going to stick with my curler. So I'm using this um, Baby by Bliss Pro curler, which I really like. I feel like this weekly vlog is kind of random. It's kind of random. It's kind of everywhere, but this is kind of my life. I just finished doing my hair, but last night I used the Revlon blow dryer just to like blow dry my hair. Like, I feel like the only time it will, my curls will stay is like when I actually curl it with a wand. Okay, hair's done. Also, update, just finished packaging these orders. I'll probably ship them out today, so I'll just put these in a bag. And then I'm going to shoot my look first because there's only going to be so much sunlight until the sun disappears in like one to two hours. <laughs> Um, and then we can get to making bubble tea update for you guys I just the photos just weren't working out I didn't really try that hard to even shoot it I was just like the lighting I don't know me it's just one of those days and also under this makeup I just am breaking out so I just feel not the best so instead <laughs> instead of trying to take photos because that's just not happening today we can make my little bubble tea okay it says boil five to six cups of water for every one cup of tapioca pearls this is what the milk oolong is looking like interesting it smells really good though it says keep it in for like five minutes so This is what the tapioca is looking like. Okay, what I want to do is put it back and put the brown sugar in there since it's hot still. Two teaspoons. Do you guys think this is enough brown sugar? I feel like I could put a little bit more. Now that I'm done with this, I feel like there's more than enough brown sugar. I feel like I put a lot of tea for the amount of... Um, Yeah, definitely put way too much tea for the amount of water I have. Like, I'm gonna put lactose milk in it because that's the only milk I have at the moment. Okay, wait, I need to taste test this so I don't mess it up. So I'm gonna do a scoop of this. This is my sample run. This does not look pretty. Maybe I should put some more tea in it. Okay. It works. Okay. A little bit of milk. Okay. 
Okay, I'm gonna sample this one and see if it's good. Mmm, this is amazing. Let me get one for everyone. Okay, so the key is the brown sugar was really important to put a lot in the tapioca. A splash of milk. A splash of milk. And then I have metal straws for both. Let's get all their reactions. So I'm gonna let my mom try this. Just mix it and then drink it. Very good. <laughs> what would you rate it out of 10, mother? I would rate it a good nine and a half. Wow, guys, a nine and a half. This is for you. No. Thank you. Okay, guys, I'm in the middle of shooting, but my sister decided to give me her ratings. Nicole, please share your ratings. I give it an eight. An eight? She changed it from a 7.5 to an eight. And because why is tapioca that? Tapioca is very good. It's nice and chewy, better than cha time. Wow, better than cha time? Okay, we're gonna be making bubble tea from home from now on. You are, thanks. <laughs> Okay guys, I'm back in my PJs and I found, I had this box that they gave me and I forgot about it. Like, this is where the tea was supposed to be in and then I just dip it in each drink. Noted for next time. <laughs> Sorry guys in advance that this vlog was a little short, but thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you guys enjoyed and see you guys next time. Bye guys.